Ubuntu Sky Shield USSAD, South Africa's vision for a next-generation air defense system. Ubuntu Sky Shield USSAD, represents a conceptual vision of South Africa's next-generation integrated air defense system, designed to reflect the country's growing focus on technological self-reliance, regional security, and modern defensive warfare. The name, Ubuntu, is deeply rooted in African philosophy, symbolizing unity, shared responsibility, and collective protection. In the context of air defense, Ubuntu Sky Shield embodies the idea that national security is not only about military strength but also about cooperation between technology, personnel, and strategic planning to safeguard airspace, infrastructure, and civilian populations. At its core, Ubuntu Sky Shield is imagined as a multi-layered air defense solution capable of countering a wide spectrum of aerial threats. Modern airspace is no longer challenged only by traditional fighter jets or bombers, it now includes drones, cruise missiles, low-flying aircraft, and emerging hypersonic threats. USSAD is envisioned to address these challenges through an integrated network of sensors, radar systems, command centers, and interceptor units working together in real time. This network-centric approach allows faster detection, identification, and response, which is essential in today's high-speed combat environment. One of the defining features of Ubuntu Sky Shield is its advanced radar architecture. The system would rely on a combination of long-range surveillance radar, medium-range tracking radar, and short-range target acquisition sensors. These radars would likely include active electronically scanned array AESA technology, offering improved accuracy, resistance to jamming, and the ability to track multiple targets simultaneously. Positioned strategically across South Africa's territory, such radar units could provide continuous coverage over land, coastline, and key economic zones, including ports, airbases, and urban centers. The command and control structure of Ubuntu Sky Shield is envisioned as fully digital and highly automated, while still allowing human operators to make final decisions. A central command hub would fuse data from all sensors, creating a real-time air picture displayed on advanced consoles. Artificial intelligence-assisted software could help prioritize threats, predict flight paths, and recommend optimal interception solutions. This reduces reaction time and minimizes the risk of human error, while maintaining strict rules of engagement to prevent accidental engagements. Mobility is another key concept behind Ubuntu Sky Shield. Rather than relying solely on fixed installations, the system would be designed around mobile, truck-mounted platforms. These platforms could carry radar units, missile launchers, and command modules, allowing rapid redeployment in response to changing threat environments. Mobility enhances survivability, as systems can be relocated to avoid detection or targeting, and it also supports South Africa's need to protect vast and diverse terrain, from coastal regions to inland savannas. In terms of interception capability, Ubuntu Sky Shield is imagined as a layered missile defense system. Short-range interceptors would be responsible for countering drones, helicopters, and low-altitude threats, while medium-range missiles could engage aircraft and cruise missiles at greater distances. A long-range interceptor layer would provide area defense against high-value threats approaching from far beyond national borders. This layered approach ensures redundancy. If one layer fails or is overwhelmed, others can still provide protection. Electronic warfare resistance would be a critical requirement for USSAD. Modern conflicts have shown that jamming, spoofing, and cyber attacks can be as dangerous as physical weapons. Ubuntu Sky Shield would therefore be designed with hardened communication links, encrypted data transmission, and anti-jamming radar modes. Cybersecurity measures would protect command networks from intrusion, ensuring that the system remains operational even in contested electromagnetic environments. South Africa's defense industry has a long history of innovation, particularly during periods of international isolation when domestic solutions were essential. Ubuntu Sky Shield builds on this legacy by emphasizing local development and manufacturing wherever possible. Radar components, software systems, and vehicle platforms could be produced by South African defense companies, creating skilled jobs and reducing reliance on foreign suppliers. At the same time, Selective international partnerships could provide access to advanced technologies while maintaining national control over critical systems. From a strategic perspective, Ubuntu Sky Shield would not be intended as an offensive weapon,
but as a purely defensive system aligned with South Africa's constitutional commitment to peace and stability. Its primary mission would be the protection of sovereignty, critical infrastructure, and civilian airspace. By strengthening air defense, South Africa could deter potential aggressors, reduce vulnerability to coercion, and contribute to regional stability in Southern Africa. The system's role in regional security cooperation is another important dimension. Ubuntu Sky Shield could be integrated into shared early warning arrangements with neighboring countries, supporting collective responses to transnational threats such as terrorism, illegal trafficking, and unauthorized airspace incursions. This cooperative approach reflects the spirit of Ubuntu, extending protection beyond borders through collaboration and trust. Training and human capital development would be central to the success of Ubuntu Sky Shield. Advanced systems are only as effective as the people who operate and maintain them. Specialized training programs for radar operators, missile technicians, and command staff would be required, along with simulation facilities to rehearse complex scenarios. By investing in education and skills development, South Africa could ensure long-term operational readiness and technological independence. Logistics and sustainment are often overlooked but critical aspects of air defense systems. Ubuntu Sky Shield would be designed with maintainability in mind, using modular components that can be replaced or upgraded without extensive downtime. A robust supply chain for spare parts, coupled with predictive maintenance software, would help keep the system operational over extended periods. This is particularly important for a country with large geographic distances and varied operating conditions. Environmental considerations could also influence the design philosophy of Ubuntu Sky Shield. Modern defense systems increasingly aim to reduce their environmental footprint through efficient power usage, reduced emissions, and minimized impact on surrounding ecosystems. Mobile units might use hybrid power solutions, combining diesel generators with battery storage or renewable energy sources for certain operations. Such measures align with South Africa's broader commitments to sustainability. In a broader geopolitical context, Ubuntu Sky Shield symbolizes South Africa's intention to remain a technologically capable and strategically autonomous nation. As global power dynamics evolve and aerial threats become more complex, having a credible air defense capability is essential for maintaining strategic flexibility. USSAD would allow South Africa to protect its interests without Escalating tensions are engaging in arms races, reinforcing a posture of defensive strength and responsible stewardship. The conceptual design of Ubuntu Sky Shield also reflects lessons learned from recent global conflicts, where integrated air defense systems have played decisive roles. The importance of redundancy, adaptability, and rapid decision-making has become clear. USS adds networked architecture and layered defenses are intended to address these lessons, ensuring resilience even under sustained pressure. Ultimately, Ubuntu Sky Shield is more than just a military system, it is a representation of South Africa's strategic vision for the future. By combining advanced technology, local innovation, and cooperative security principles, USSAD embodies a modern approach to national defense rooted in African values. While conceptual in nature, the idea of Ubuntu Sky Shield highlights what is possible when a nation aligns its technological ambitions with its philosophical foundations. In conclusion, Ubuntu Sky Shield USSAD, stands as a compelling vision of a next-generation air defense system tailored to South Africa's unique needs and values. Through integrated sensors, mobile platforms, layered interception, and robust command and control, it addresses the realities of modern aerial threats. At the same time, its emphasis on cooperation, sustainability, and domestic capability reflects a broader commitment to responsible defense. As airspace becomes an increasingly contested domain, concepts like Ubuntu Sky Shield illustrate how technology and philosophy can come together to protect not just borders, but the people and principles within them.